Hello, I hope you're okay. My name is Kate and in this video we're going to be doing afternoon tea. We're going to make sausage rolls kind of from scratch. Uh, Lee's going to do it actually. So I'm going to film Lee making the sausage rolls. We're going to get some sandwiches and we're going to have a pot of tea. And last night Lee made a little cake. So we're going to make some afternoon tea and we thought we would do a video as well. And I've got a special guest here who's going to be helping me. Hello. Oh, oh one to your face. What? What's happened? Do you need to go to the dentist? No. What's happened? <laughs> we discovered. Oh, you look good. Let me have a go. We discovered. Um, Hold on. We had some face mats in the. Hello. In the in the cupboard, and so mm. we've just been. Oh, this is a nice one. Look at this one. Oh, oh they hurt your nose a bit though. Oh, that's a. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh my God, that's hurt my nose. <laughs> Oh, that was good. Woo! <laughs> so Toby's going to be doing afternoon tea with me yes. and Lee as well. And then we're going to take it out to the greenhouse and put it out all nicely. So we thought we'd do a video and film it as well. And yeah. Oh, mug of the day. So before we get going, I've got to my mug of the day. It's just sitting here. I've actually drunk all the coffee, but this is my mug of the day. It was from Primark ages ago. Well, that side's gone a bit funny, but this one's... This one's okay. So this is my mug of the day. And now we're gonna make some sausage rolls and get the sandwiches all ready. This is what we're gonna be using to make the sausage rolls. So we've got some butter and that little pan, some phyllo pastry. I used this before actually when I did my curry pie. Two onions with a chopping board, some sausages. I was gonna use veggie sausages, but Lee wanted these ones. So we've got um, reduced fat, eight pork sausages from Tesco so we're going to be using those but obviously you could use what you like some salt and pepper and then a bowl. We've boiled some eggs and just got some bread ready for sandwiches and Lee is just chopping the onions you can see Rufus's tail wagging there. Hello. 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 <laughs> Look at Toby. Oh nice what's that? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to chop the onions. Lee doesn't mind chopping them. My Makes my eyes water. Does it yours? Onions. <laughs> onions have gone in. They're just <laughs> taking the sausage meat out of the sauce. That's really disgusting, isn't mm. it? This is really disgusting. You can obviously buy um, sausage meat from the butchers or use oh, vegetarian yeah. Yeah, sausages. Might, might, might be less disgusting. Squeeze. Just squeezing it all out. <laughs> so we're just going to do that mixed with the onions and then probably add some pepper and salt. Is that oh, right? I'm doing it. I'm doing yeah, it. Yeah, I think you can add all, all sorts of things. Well, it depends what you want. Yeah, I'm doing it. Or like a bit of apple or something. Yeah. Ooh. And we've got eight sausages in here mixed with onions and salt and pepper. And we're just melting some butter in a pan. We've just put some flour down on the surface and we're going to roll out the phyllo pastry on here so it doesn't stick to the worktop. And now Lee is putting the melted butter onto the phyllo pastry. We finally got a brush. It's better having a brush, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. You do have just a big paintbrush. You probably do. Big paintbrush, but with no paint on. Okay. A brand new big paintbrush yeah. that you've cleaned. Yeah. <laughs> and hopefully you won't get any bristles on your sausage rolls. And I'm going to be serving the afternoon tea on this trio. And I've got quite a few of these. We um, bought them for our wedding this year because we were having afternoon tea. Not sure if the wedding's going ahead or not. So I just grabbed that one it's out of... What's that? Layers of okay, hang on. Let me go back over. Anyway, I'm using that. That's what I'm trying to say. Oh, I just... Bashed it. You're doing layers. Yeah. Oh, okay. So on top of each other. Yeah. Why is that then? Well, it's quite thin, isn't it? And I think it just crisps up. And you know, like you layer it up oh, on yeah. that pie. Oh yeah. Yeah. Have you watched a video on this then? Oh, that's a little one. A little quick one. Hey. It did, <laughs> it did say because that goes hard quite quick. You can cover it up with a wet tea <laughs> towel. Hey. Oh, okay. If it goes hard too quick, chuck a wet tea towel on it. Lee is now putting the sausage and onion mixture in the phyllo pastry. What was I going? Oh, you're making one big one. Oh, I thought of little ones. Well, then you chop them up. Yeah, that's, that's a good idea. My brain works differently. What was I going to say? And I think... Oh, I've forgotten. Oh, yeah, you don't cook this first. This goes in the oven. Or in our case, into the arga. So we put it on a tray with some baking paper and a bit more butter. Do you have to fold the edges or do they stay open? Um, I'll put that at the bottom then it should just cook. I've never made sausage rolls before but Lee used to make them with his 
Nan years ago when he was little. Oh, do you remember? Do you remember making I remember them? Eating them? Oh, really? Were they nice? Yeah, best sausage rolls ever. Oh. Right, and then we'll do another one. Toby's disappeared. He's outside on his trampoline. I think he's going to enjoy eating them as well. And I'm going to add an apple to one of the sausage rolls. So I'm going to quickly chop this up and add it. It's just a normal eating apple. I think it's a Braeburn. And so that is the apple added to this sausage roll. So that might be quite nice. Oh, there we go. So the bus is going on the last one. So we've got two large sausage rolls and they're just going to go in the oven for how long? Um, it says 20 to 25 minutes, I think, but we've put tin foil on this time because... Someone gave us this tip. Thank you very much if that was you that gave us this tip. So they're going to go in our argon. And if you have a normal oven, it probably will be longer for the sausage roll. So if you are making these, double check on the internet with how long you need to put them in your oven for, because obviously our argon um, is quite powerful. So they'll be done a little bit quicker. How many eggs are in there? Six. Six eggs mashed up with some mayonnaise, salt and pepper. So that's the eggs for our sandwiches and there was some leftover phyllo pastry so we've chucked some jam in here and some butter and i'm going to hope for the best i'm going to put that in the oven as well i'm going to do finger sandwiches so i've cut like one piece of bread into four and then cut the crusts off i'm just going to make some cheese cucumber and coleslaw sandwiches as well and these are the cakes that lee made yesterday it's carrot cake it was a tray bake uh dr Erker or that baking make so he did this last night, so I'm going to place this on the top of my three-tier afternoon tea plate thing. And I'm going to have my afternoon tea in here. Lee and Toby are going to eat theirs, but I'm going to have mine in here all by myself. But it's fine because I've got you to keep me company. So I've just got my pot of tea, some milk and a lovely little um, vintage china trio teacup set. And then I put some flowers here the other day because I took some pictures for Instagram. So they're just some lovely bluebells I picked from our garden. They look lovely there as well. It smells really nice in here, I think, because the flowers. They've kind of gone paler as well, I think, because they're in here. They've gone quite pale and beautiful. And we've got Rufus as well. So we're not by ourselves. I better get you some gravy bones and put them on a separate little dish because it's not fair otherwise, is it? No. So this is all set up and I'm now going to go and check on the sausage rolls see how they're doing. Look how lovely the weather is. Gorgeous today. I didn't expect this. Didn't think it'd be this nice. It's lovely seeing all the blossom on the trees. Hello blossom. It's warm enough to sit outside but I want to um, have afternoon tea in the greenhouse because I just think it looked really pretty in there but it's lovely and warm. I thought it'd be a lot colder today. Come on Rufus. Right, I'm going to get him some little gravy bones as well. How are they doing? Good, I think. They've been in for quite a while, longer than we thought. Yeah, I'd had the tin foil open, which was good because it's not all the time. Okay. Like it was a long, sort of okay, they're going back in. Uh, into burn, no. Think. How's my little funny parcel going? Pilo um, pastry parcel. <laughs> Do you want to try it? I just didn't want to waste the stuff, so we just put some jam in there. I put some sugar on it as well. I don't know why, but it doesn't look too bad. I don't know what it'll taste like. I just didn't want to let everything go to waste. It kind of looks like a brown paper bag, crumbled up. <laughs> and we think they're just about done. Which one's the apple one, the one on the right? Is that the apple one? I can't remember. Mm. I think maybe, I don't know. The they look more one, cooked. They look a bit juicy because probably the apple. Yeah, maybe the apple Ooh. I've just put two on here. So I've got the apple one and the normal one the sandwiches and the cakes on top. So I'm just gonna take this outside to the greenhouse. So I'm gonna make it all pretty, pour myself some tea and then do a few pictures for Instagram. And I've got some gravy bones for Rufus. So he's got a biscuit bone and a gravy bone. Rufus, do you want a gravy bone? He's off. <laughs> oh, I love this, it's so cute. Right, I'm gonna pour some tea and then make it look all lovely and then I'll try everything. I haven't tried it yet. Love a teapot. I can't believe I never really drank tea out of a teapot and now it's just the best thing ever. I suppose it's the time. You don't normally have time to drink out of a teapot. You just make a mu like a mug of tea and you plop in some milk and I'll do a couple of pictures for Instagram. Oh I've got my spoon. I always forget my spoon when I come over here. I've just taken a load of pictures for Instagram. It's getting quite warm in here, so I've opened the windows. 
and got my tea. Let's have a bit of my tea. Cheers, everyone. Cheers. Oh. Mm. That's so nice for a teapot. And I'm going to try. Oh, this is the funny puff phyllo pastry pie thing. Tastes really nice. I'm glad I didn't waste it. I hate waste. I just thought I'll make something and just chuck some jam in, put some butter on it, shoved it in the oven. That tastes really nice. It's quite a nice breakfast type thing. I've got my milk here, but I've already got it in my tea. I'm going to pull over the afternoon tea. Da, da, da. I've never made this before, anything like this. I've made sandwiches before, obviously, but not like a whole thing like this. Oh, it's so cute. Look, yay. So lovely. Okay. So I'll have a little sandwich. And then I think the sausage rolls are still quite hot. Oh no, I just dropped egg on my trousers. They're only pajama trousers, so it doesn't matter. The egg sandwich is lovely, so I'll have the rest of that in a minute. And I'm gonna try, so I'm gonna try the apple one. The apple sausage roll, I've made sausage rolls. Here we go. I might have some pastry on my face, but that tastes amazing. It's so good, really nice. I think because it's the reduced fat sausages, they're not kind of as porky or they're just, I don't know, they're, the meat is leaner. They taste amazing. I would have preferred vegetarian sausage rolls. I do love a veggie sausage more than a normal sausage. I do like chicken sausages, but I don't know. They might have been a bit strange, but yeah, I really like that. That's really nice. I'm gonna eat the rest of this and then eat the carrot cake that Lee made last night. Little tray bait, so I just cut them up into little squares. So that's my afternoon tea. Yay! I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm now going to um, scoff the lot because um, I'm, I'm a bit hungry and I haven't had breakfast yet. There's not that much there, it's like a normal lunch. Well, it's a bit more than normal lunch. Um, so I'm going to eat all of this and drink my tea. But I hope you enjoyed the video and you enjoyed making afternoon tea with us. So if you did like the video, no, if you enjoyed the video, give it a like and make sure you subscribe as well. And I will speak to you tomorrow at eight in the morning with another video. And I'll link the last few videos that I've put on lately. There was a cherries haul from yesterday. Monday there was a what I eat in a day type of a video. And then there were some different ones over the weekend. There was a utility room makeover, a kitchen organising video and a few different ones. So I will link them in the description and come down with us as well. I'll link those in the description too with my Instagram um, account. So thanks for watching. I'll speak to you soon. Take care. Stay safe. Bye.